Dear Tara, spending the last five seasons with you has been extraordinary. You're smart, you're driven, you're funny, you're motivated, you're an excellent psychoanalyst, forensic psychologist, and a good friend, and above all, you a bad, bad bitch. I'm gonna miss you. A goodbye to Spencer. You know, I can't say a, a goodbye to Spencer because he, I'm very fortunate. I have him in my heart always. I look up to him. I, uh, I feel very honored to have gotten to play the, the character for so long, and he'll always be a piece of me. Dear Matt, oh wow, I don't know what to say. Just want to say thank you, man, for being such an amazing man, great father, a loyal teammate, being dedicated to your job and your country, for the bravery, for loving your children and your wife so much, and for allowing me to spend time with you. Uh, I will miss, miss you dearly, and uh, all I can say is thank you. It's been a ride, man. Well, this is it, my man. We had a, a great run to stop some bad people, and we had a good time with some good people, and uh, this is where we say farewell, Luke. So uh, thank you for a good time. Give Roxy a big hug and kiss for me. Oh, I'm not gonna cry. Um, oh, I, Paget Brewster. I say thank you, Emily Prentice. I can't say goodbye. It's still gonna be on in reruns. I'm not saying goodbye. <sighs> there has been no greater honor in my life than being the guardian of this figment of my imagination and an imagination of a, an amazing costume department and sound department and writers and directors and, um, and to make something up in a room full of people who are also making their things up and bouncing off of each other and, and figuring all that out is been like such a gift. And then people watch it apparently, even though I thought I was just in a room by myself or with my friends talking about gory stuff. She's not, she's not gone. She lives inside of you. You're in our Penelope Garcia that lives inside of us all. So make sure you take good care of her. You know, it's not, it's easy for me to say goodbye to David Rossi because David Rossi's still around because I actually named my character after an LAPD policeman who I know named David Rossi. And it was kind of, you know, I, I chose that name as a bit of an homage to all law enforcement people everywhere and in every walk of life. And uh, Dave's still around. He's retired, lives up in Idaho. So Dave, I know you, <laughs> I turned the name back over to you, you know, but I was proud to carry that name for, for my whole duration of working on Criminal Minds. And it was, it's my tip of the hat to everybody in law enforcement who, over the years who've sometimes sacrificed even their lives uh, for the rest of us. This is the long awaited goodbye to JJ. Um, who she grew up in front of all of your eyes, and uh, so did I, and we're very, very closely, uh, I don't wanna cry. <laughs> I, have, I have learned so much from JJ, and um, it's been cool to see her evolve and become the badass mother, nurturer, uh, amazing woman and I will really miss really miss playing her um, but the good thing is that she now lives in my heart and I get to pretend to be more like JJ every day I'm trying so thank you JJ and I will miss you <laughs>